model of the scapula with a quiz. The posterior aspect of the left scapula. The first anatomical structure we will look at is the acromion. The acromion is the point of attachment for the deltoid and trapezius muscles and articulates with the clavicle. Here we can see the coracoid process which is on the anterior side of the scapula. This pointed area is a lateral angle. This is the infraspinous fossa point of attachment for a muscle. The lateral border the medial border. This is the spine of the scapula which leads into the acromion process and up here at the very top is the superior angle. Now you can quiz yourself. All you have to do here is hit pause on the video and write down what you think the anatomical parts of the scapula are. When you're ready start the video back and you will see a labeled picture of this bone once again. Let's see how you did. This is the labeled picture of the scapula once again to compare to. This is the anterior aspect of the left scapula. Here we can see the coracoid process much more clearly, and the coracoid process is the point of attachment of the pectoralis minor muscles. Down here is the glenoid cavity, or glenoid fossa, which articulates with the head of the humerus. At the very bottom is the inferior angle, the subscapular fossa, and the suprascapular notch. This notch serves as the passage of the suprascapular nerve. Here is your chance to test yourself on the anterior aspect of the scapula. Just pause the video, list what you think each of these numbers are, and then start the video back and you can check your work. Okay, let's see how you did.